So here we have another example for uh, construction of Turing machine. So design a Turing machine to compute one's complement. Okay, so what is one's complement of any binary number here? So when I take the number as one zero 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 one, it is like wherever you have one, it have to, uh, has to have it as zero. Okay, so all the ones has to be converted to zero, zero has to be converted to one. So this is your one's complement, right? So for this, we have to construct a Turing machine. So when you are constructing a Turing machine, uh, your input will be written in the tape. Whatever is the input that is written in the tape, it might be either the combination of zero or one. It will be written in the tape and the remaining symbols will be blank. And we have a rewrite head that focuses on the first element and the transition will be in the starting state. This, this is the standard one. We cannot make a modification at all. Okay, so here, what we are going to do in Q0, when the input is zero, it has to be converted to one and we can move right. So we are going to do it for all the zeros converted to one, for all the ones we are going to convert to zero. So you can write the transition as Q0 so we can have a single state for doing it. Okay, in Q0, when the input is zero, zero will be converted to one and move right. So the zero will be converted to one first element and the remaining input will remain as it is. I'm sorry, it is one, zero, zero, one blank. It will remain as it is, we'll be remaining in Q0 state. And when the input is one, one will be converted to zero, move right. So this one will be converted to zero, move right to Q0 state. And Q0, when it reaches a zero, the zero will be converted to one, move right. In Q0, when the input is zero, zero will be converted to one, move right. In Q0, when the input is one, one will be converted to zero, move right. So your transition will look like this, tape will look like this, one, zero, one, one, zero, blank. So after converting this one to zero, we are making a right side move to Q naught state, right? It is a self loop. We have only one state and for all the zeros converted to one, all the ones converted to zero, you're going to scan from left to right. And finally, when it reaches the blank symbol, the input is totally done, right? So what we can do, we can just move one step ahead to Q accepting state. Okay, so the transition can be given as, so this is your end. So we can make uh, this blank will remain as it is, and we can make a left side move for Q accepting state. Very simple. This is the final transition diagram. Okay, so this is a computation problem of Turing machine. So far we have discussed that a power n, b power n function or uh, uh, a, a star, b, b star function and all. So all those problems, we have a, a rejection states and all. But for these kind of uh, problems, like where it has to make a computation during machine as a computable devices, we don't have any special rejection state. Okay, we can directly go for acceptance, complete the process, go for acceptance, that is it, done. Okay, thank you.